busing may lead to controversy when it involves school children, but it seems to work out fine when applied to the workforce. A number of large companies in association with local transit systems are making discount transit passes available to their employees. I think we're all bozos on this bus. You get up every morning from the long clocks, one and take the 815 into the city. So far, employer pass programs are underway in Chicago, Dallas, Boston, Pittsburgh, Hartford, and other cities. Employers have often provided free parking space for employees who drive to work, but until now, little was done to subsidize workers who used mass transit. What have you done for me lately? Some states require large employers to report what efforts the companies have made to promote carpooling or use of public transportation. Transit pass programs seem to fit the bill perfectly. Did I pass one? No, no, but the fox did. Squeeze him right there, maybe he'll pass another one. <laughs> Don't pass me by. At the same time, transit authorities are trying to convince more companies to get involved with pass programs. The mass transit officials see the discount passes as the best way to increase the number of riders and ease their perennial deficits. Driving that train. I took the train, because I take trains a lot, but, uh, you know, it's mostly old people and myself who just sit in a lounge car <laughs> and they tell me what a great President Harding was. All aboard! Generally, the discount passes allow the bearer unlimited transit use for a set price. Savings average about $50 a year. But they find a way to make you pay, pay, pay. But for now, it doesn't appear the discount passes will be made available to the individual man or woman on the street. They already use mass transit and don't need further enticement, according to transit officials. But those who get the passes appear to be making the most of the token gesture. Cause he gets up in the morning, then he goes to work at night, then he comes back home with 5.30, gets the same train every time. Tom Powell on the News Blimp. Woo!